How do gliders actually fly? What keeps them in the air? And how are they controlled? A glider has very specialized wings, very long and extremely efficient. They generate lift. The fuselage contains a cockpit with a pilot seat and some instruments. The altimeter is a dual pointer instrument in feet or meter. The fat needle shows thousands, the thin needle shows hundreds. The variometer indicates if we are climbing or sinking meters per second. Here we have a three meters per second climb. The airspeed indicator. Landing approach speed is about 100 kilometers per hour and touchdown is about 70 kilometers per hour. A glider is launched by aero towing for an altitude of approximately 500 meters above ground. Then we have to find our own thermals or we do a winch launch with 0 to 100 kilometers per hour in 2 seconds and some have a motor for self launch the tail assembly has the rudder left right and the elevator for nick with forward slash Backward, on the stick, we control the nick. The rudder is controlled by both feet. With left-right, we control the ailerons for roll, which are in both wings. For landing, we use the air brakes. They extrude from the wing surface. They disturb the airflow and increase the sink rate. To stay up in the air, we try to find warm, raising air, and we circle in it to gain altitude. If we don't find enough lift, we have to land, sometimes on a field. But we can disassemble the machine, which needs about 30 to 60 minutes.